Bonjour guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, we're going to do a problem on ranking passive and active earth pressure. For more videos covering the engineering problems or AP exam questions, don't forget to subscribe and make sure you hit the bell so you get notified when I release new videos every Tuesday and Friday. Also, make sure you watch until the end because I'm going to share with you some practice problems that you can use to study for your test. Oh yeah, everybody now. So one of my students asked me this question and I wanted to share it with you guys. When to use the Rankine Active and Passive Earth Pressure? So if we look at the equations on page 154, you guys will see here that we usually use it only if we are trying to calculate for the effective horizontal force. Now note guys that to calculate for the horizontal force, we have to calculate first the effective stress and the pore water pressure. Now we only use the Rankine Earth Pressure for the effective vertical stress. We don't multiply it for the pore water pressure. Now in the FE exam, if you are asked to calculate for the effective stress and you are giving the ranking earth pressure, don't use it. All you gotta do is just use these equations here or these equations. Now I already did the problem on this in one of my videos. I will leave the link above in case you guys wanna check it out, but just don't apply the ranking pressure. Okay, so the only time we use it is when we're trying to find the effective horizontal force and only we multiply it for the effective stress and not the pore water pressure. So this is a summary of what we just talked about. So use Rankine earth pressure to calculate the lateral or horizontal force and only for the effective stress. And don't use Rankine earth pressure if you have to calculate the vertical effective stress and don't ever multiply it for the pore water pressure. If you guys want some practice problems or some cheat sheets, you can visit my website, scroll all the way to the bottom, enter your email address, and I will send them to you along with some tips on how to tackle this exam. If you guys have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. If you like this video, please give me a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe for new videos every Tuesday and Friday. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you soon. A la prochaine. Oh yeah, everybody now.